We smashed every record crossing the ocean at a high speed, 165 knots, 11 and a half hours. And believe it or not, we used 42 gallons and uh, we, we still had three hours for safety. A game changer in the small uh, category aircraft. I am Andrea Venturini, I'm a pilot. I'm Alberto Porto, designer of Recent. We flew from Italy to Stornoway in Scotland to Goose Bay direct, from Goose Bay, Appleton, very close by. We still have here the, the raft, here all the tools we've been using for crossing the Atlantic. Long wave radio, satellite phone, tracker, a survival suit. Obviously you need to be very well prepared for doing something like this. It's a little bit of weather on the departure, so we had to dodge the clouds, but then after an hour in the ocean, we could climb up a little bit higher and we had clear sky and all we had to do is to do the fuel management. We took off from Voghera, just south of Milan, landed in this island that it was not never used before for this kind of crossing, Stornoways, the West Isles of the Hebrides in Scotland. And when we got to Greenland, uh, we didn't stop and people started going crazy, say, what, the, what are they doing? What are they doing? Here's a picture of how close we were to the Matterhorn. Here we are in the middle of the ocean. We start seeing so many icebergs. And here it is, uh, epic, like uh, Christopher Columbus, land, land. The whole trip, the airplane never felt the turbulence. It was very comfortable. We did it with a, a small Rotax, a small plane, two seaters. We did it 165 knots and that's what really makes it very special. We are very proud and I'm very proud to be part of uh, Porto Aviation Group.